Imagine a giant fireball constantly throwing off charged particles and bursts of energy. That's our sun. Sometimes, these outbursts become supercharged, creating solar storms. These storms come into main flavors, solar flares, which are intense bursts of radiation, and coronal mass ejections, CMS, which are huge clouds of magnetized plasma hurtling towards Earth. Solar storms aren't all bad news. The charged particles can actually enhance auroras, creating those breathtaking displays of dancing lights in the polar skies. They can also be beneficial for some communication systems, reflecting radio waves over longer distances. But here's the shocker. A strong solar storm could wreak havoc on our technology-dependent world. Power grids could overload, satellites could malfunction, and GPS navigation could be disrupted. Imagine a world without internet, ATMs, or even traffic lights. Yikes! The sun goes through cycles of activity, with periods of high and low solar flares and CMS. Currently, we're in solar cycle 25, which is expected to peak in July 2025. Scientists predict this will be a moderately strong cycle, not the strongest on record. So, will a monstrous solar storm hit us in 2025? The honest answer is, we can't say for sure. Predicting the exact strength of individual storms is tricky. However, there's a good chance we'll see more solar activity in the coming years. The potential effects of a strong solar storm depend on its intensity and direction. A major CME could induce powerful currents in our power grids, causing widespread blackouts. Critical infrastructure like communication networks and GPS systems could also be disrupted. Our day-to-day -day lives could be significantly impacted, with disruptions to transportation, finance, and even emergency services. The good news is, we're not sitting ducks. Scientists are constantly monitoring the sun, and advanced warning systems can provide us with hours to days of notice before a major storm hits. This allows us to take precautions, like shutting down power grids and protecting sensitive electronics. Here's what you can do. Stay informed. Follow reliable sources like an OAAS Space Weather Prediction Center for updates. Have a plan. Develop a communication plan and emergency kit in case of a power outage. Consider surge protectors. They can help safeguard your electronics from voltage spikes. In March 1989, a powerful solar storm caused a nine-hour blackout in Quebec, Canada affecting millions of people. More recently, in 2012, a massive CME barely missed Earth. Highlighting the ongoing risk, these real-life examples show just how significant the impact of solar storms can be. Technological advancements play a crucial role in mitigating the effects of solar storms. Satellites like NASA's Solar Dynamics Observatory SDO, and the European Space Agency's Solar Orbiter are dedicated to studying the sun's activity. Their observations help scientists better understand and predict solar storms, enhancing our ability to prepare for them. Solar storms are a natural phenomenon, but by understanding them and taking precautions, we can minimize their impact. Remember, knowledge is power, even when it comes to the power of the sun. Let me know in the comments below what questions you have about solar storms, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more space science adventures. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe to our channel for more fascinating space content. Hit the bell icon to stay updated on our latest videos. See you next time, and stay curious.